Let's start with the basics. This is a simple screen with a label. The idea is that we'll get this value from the slider. To create it, right click in your hierarchy and select UI slider. This is the default look of the slider. If we run the game, we can actually see that it works out of the box, but there are quite a few important properties we might want to look at. First one is a direction of our slider. For example, if we would like to create a slider like on audio interfaces, you can change it to bottom to top. That way, the highest values are on the top and the lowest on the bottom. In fact, you can see how the values change when I move it. Mean and max value is pretty self-explanatory and whole numbers transforms it into a step slider. If we change the max value to 5 and run the game with the whole numbers enabled, you can see that the slider basically jumps between those whole number values. Finally, the value field allows you to set the value on the game start.